couldn't control the defenses. They're all trapped inside. Solus, I take it you study spirits? I do. Back in my homeland, we keep spirits as servants. So I have been told. The things they can be made to do are quite marvelous. You should see them. The Tavinta Imperium is not the safest place for an elf. Ah, yes. Quite safe.
Who's there? Don't come any closer. We have swords. There is no need for alarm. We are the Inquisition, and this is the Herald of Andraste. The Herald of Andraste? Maker's breath! Forgive me, I should have known. Commander Jihan, in service of Her Imperial Majesty, long may she reign. My men inform me that the Citadel's defenses are deactivated. I cannot thank you enough. I found one of your soldiers at the Eastern Ramparts. She wanted you to have this. Fabian's ring. She is gone then. I hoped, I prayed that she yet lived. Thank you, I... I will make sure this gets to her family. Tell me about the situation here. There were orders. A chance for peace, they said. Pull back, they said. So we did. Then the Arden dead appeared. We couldn't hold them back. I told my men to activate the fort's defenses. A foolish move, born of desperation. There was so much about the old elven magic we never knew. We couldn't control it. We retreated, but not everyone made it through the gates. I couldn't. I couldn't save them. We've been trapped for weeks. Supplies were incoming, but who knows what happened to them. I must take my leave. Good day, Inquisitor.
maybe. Almost every Orlesian noble keeps a winter home in the Dales. It's a mark of status. Stefan. What have you done now? I get it, Seeker. You're still sore after our spat. I'm not a child, Varric. Do not suggest I'm without reason. Uh, a peace offering. The next chapter of Swords and Shields. I hear you're a fan. This is your doing. I was hoping you'd be happy about it. Well, if you're not interested, you're not interested. Still needs editing anyhow. Wait! <laughs> you're probably wondering what happens to the night captain after the last chapter. <gasps> Nothing should happen to her. She was falsely accused. Well, it turns out the guardsman... Don't tell me! <clears throat> this is the part where you thank the Inquisitor. I don't normally give sneak peeks, after all. I... thank you. Varric's the one you should be thanking. I am but a humble servant to my loyal readers. I wonder if I have time to read the first part. But don't forget to tell all your friends, if you have any. Ah, <sighs> completely worth it. Planning troop movements now. I'm trying to imagine what it will look like when we're done. All of this once belonged to the Tevinta Imperium. Andraste changed that, as did the Blights. As for what will come next, I cannot guess the Maker's plan. We make the world a better place. Because everyone agrees on what better means. I know. I want a world where people trust the Chantry and that trust is respected. I want to respect tradition, but not fear change. I want to right past wrongs, but not avenge them. And I have no idea if my wanting these things makes any of them right.
Even if they're not right, they're certainly admirable. Some would disagree. They would call it heresy. That didn't sound like the ravings of a heretic, Cassandra. Perhaps not. But it takes precious little effort to paint even an act of compassion as damaging. Tell me, what guides you? You make decisions that shake the world, yet always seem so assured. I wish I had your confidence. You almost sound like you admire me. I absolutely do. I may not always agree with your decisions, but how many could do what you have done? You were a prisoner, accused and reviled, yet you've emerged from every trial victorious. The Maker's grace does not make you immortal. You live or die by your own hand. That is worthy of admiration. I'm guided by what my conscience tells me. Your conscience must speak more clearly than mine. I doubt it, but I do my best. Think of it. Like Andraste long ago, once again the fate of Thedas will be determined by a woman. It makes me proud to know you. I hope we can call each other friends. I hope so too. We still have a long road to travel, Inquisitor. Wherever it takes us, I am glad you are here. What do you need, my friend? That's enough for now. Another time, then. Inquisitor, huh? Well, you've got the fortress for it. Speaking of which, when you've got a second, there's something I want to show you. What did you want me to come see? Here, come on. I'll show you. Why am I dressed like this? You'll see. Come on, it'll be worth your time, I promise. Evening. Iron Bull. My merc band just joined up. Tanner. I'm from Jader. Well, near Jader. Mira. I was guard captain for Lady Pendel. Signed on after shit blew up at the Conclave. Share a drink? Who's your friend? This is Grim. She doesn't talk much. It's a pleasure. Hey, Graham. Do I know you from somewhere? So, you ready to kill some demons? Or Venatori, or whatever that Corypheus asshole is? This isn't just about killing. We're helping the Inquisitor save the world and build the next empire. Sounds like the Inquisitor is doing some good work. Well, long as I get paid, I'm happy. That's why I signed up. I just couldn't spend my whole life on a farm. Needed to live a little, you know. What about you, Mira? Why'd you join up? I thought you were serving some noble. I saw what happened at Haven. The Inquisitor staring down that monster and his archdemon. I don't sing the chant of light as much as I should. But you can't see something like that and not believe. Well, Grim and I should find our tents. Thanks for the drink. I know every soldier under my command. You don't have that option, but a few faces might help. You made it sound like you didn't like the Inquisition. People don't always tell the truth when you're polite. You've got to poke them a bit. But those two soldiers might think you're an asshole. So? It was good to get their perspective. Yeah. Sounds like we could use an easy win for boys like Tanner. 
and vets like Mira have seen enough to be wary. You've got a good army coming along. Remember that, no matter what comes next. <laughs>